Hello everyone, welcome again to my YouTube channel. My name is Frida. I just moved out of London to Milton Keynes, which is literally 32 minutes from London. I will show you a tour of my flat, so come with me. This is uh, a one bedroom flat, and this is what it looks like. Uh, so uh, it's quietly furnished with uh, a double bed, wardrobe from Ikea, chest of drawers also from Ikea. It came unfurnished, so literally everything was just plain. There was no wardrobe, there was no bed or chest of drawers. So moving on to the living room area. So this is what the living room area looks like, furnished by ourselves. And uh, again, the bookshelf, lots and lots of books, as you can see. Um, so that by the time we're moving out of here, it's going to be like, you know, carrying out, carrying a lot of books with us, but pretty good. And one book that I've recently got is this book, uh, Catch Me If You Can by Jessica Nabongo. And just detailing, you know, our experiences traveling the world. And she's been to every country in the world, which is just amazing. That's the goal. Um, back to the flat tour. Again, this is just a, a sort of mini dining area, two chairs and a table, which works, but most times it's not really used, to be honest. And uh, plants here, yeah, there are two plants, which pepper plants. <laughs> what the bathroom looks like it's really big i think this is the best part of this flat i've got um my shower gel um nivea i use a lot of i use nivea products a lot because that's what i prefer uh tresemme um and then so this is the mirror in the bathroom again which is really cool and the bathroom has this little um uh, cupboard here yeah, for storing stuff and the kitchen area so yeah, the kitchen area, this is what the kitchen area looks like. So it's just an open plan kitchen. As you can see, the living room is just right in front of me. And this is the living room area. So we've got open plan living room plus kitchen and the living room area is just here. And the kitchen again, just a you know, small kitchen that works really. And the hub, microwave, um, again, space, cupboard space for storing things, which is also really good. And yeah, so... This is it really. And uh, the fridge is also here. Yeah, so a uh, fridge and freezer, which works really well. And for the price, this flat is only 950 pounds per month. And as someone who has literally just um, moved out of London to live in Milton Keynes, that is like extremely cheap. Cause I remember the, f the place I used to live in in London previously, uh, I was paying about 650, which to be honest was also cheap. Cause I lived in Malibu. And which is also cheap for Malibon, but I was lucky and I got that place for 650. But then now is gonna increase the rates. I just thought, okay, I'm not gonna stay here, you know, in a single room for about 900 if I can literally move out of London. And I was working hybrid anyway, so I thought, I'm just gonna move out of London, even though I love, 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 love London so much. Because again, it's quite a small city compared to London. Um, it's not as big, it's not really busy, there's not a lot of people here like that. And if you live in Milton Keynes, you need to learn how to drive. So for me personally, I've also booked my theory test because I wasn't really concerned about, like I wasn't really bothered about, you know, learn how to drive previously. So yeah, and um, I think this is it really. And we've also got the ironing board. We have to pay bills, so energy bills. Well, we have to pay bills, energy bills, um, uh, water bills, um, cancel tax. So again, um, compared to like living in London, for example, I was just paying um paying for a room like all bills included yeah i have to split the bills but that's all right uh for like you know the convenience of coming home and you're not really sharing your place with some strangers and whatnot or people that you don't really like so that's a good thing even though i live in meeting kids if i want to get into london like literally right now i just need to literally wear my shoes get my train and in 32 minutes or 35 40 minutes or if it is flat, if it's a slow train then one hour to get into london and that is just amazing for the price um well yeah that's it really thank you so much for watching thank you so much for coming along with me and i'll see you in my next video until then bye